Good afternoon. Thanks for being here. I'm Rob Hughes. And I'm Gervier Denzup. The community is stunned as a now former Doraville police officer faces felony charges connected to a missing teen's death. That's right. Police in Gwinnett County say the officer played a role in the death of 16-year-old Susanna Morales, who was missing for more than six months. Her body was found last week near Highway 316. Atlanta News First reporter Rebecca Schramm is live near Norcross. And Rebecca, you're uncovering some new details in this case. Yeah, Rob, you know, police are telling us very little about the arrest, but I pulled the arrest warrants. I am here on Singleton Road, and somewhere right around here was where the teenage girl was last seen alive. Well, check this out, because right over here, this is the apartment complex where the officer lived. A neighbor of the now former police officer shared this video with us showing Gwinnett County police collecting evidence yesterday, including a bed sheet they found in his personal vehicle. You have two warrants, a misdemeanor and a felony. Do you already know what those are? Yes, sir. At his first court appearance, 22-year-old Miles Bryant spoke only when required. He's accused of concealing the death of 16-year-old Susanna Morales, who lived not far from his apartment near Norcross. He's also accused of filing a false report of a crime. According to the warrant, the day after Susanna disappeared, Bryant reported his vehicle was broken into and his gun was stolen. After Susanna had been missing for more than six months, someone discovered her remains last week in some woods off Highway 316 near Decula. Her sister spoke with Atlanta News First shortly after they laid Susanna to rest. Honestly, just so surprised, so surprised that he's an officer. I mean, we never expected that. And uh, maybe that's why um, everything took so long for everything to find out. But we knew that eventually everything was going to come to light. I'm going to appoint a lawyer for you. I've learned the Georgia Peace Officer Standards and Training Council suspended Bryant's police certification this morning. Your bond was denied by the judge that signed the warrant. Now, the reason given was that you are a danger to the community. Now, it's important to note that at the moment, the now ex Doraville police officer does not face a murder charge. His only felony charge at the moment is uh, concealing the death of another. Was anyone else involved? Do detectives think that this ex officer acted alone? How was Susanna killed exactly? We're going to keep working to get some answers to those questions for you. Live near Norcross, Rebecca Schramm, Atlanta News First. Yeah, all the details are quite